good morning good morning happy tuesday welcome to my channel the angels of alchemy i'm d graywell psychic medium and angelic channel and this is going to be your daily energy read for tuesday october 8th i've already pre-shuffled the cards and pulled some cards so i'm going to dive right into your reading so the first card i pulled was nightingale spirit and the message on this card is love is all around and i feel like there's a big message here about not seeking love outside of yourself and recognizing that love is within you but this is also about recognizing that love is within all, regardless of the situations that have played out in your life with people, with relationships, um, you need to see the love vibration in everyone because love is what we are, it is who we are. Underneath that, you have the Queen of Pentacles. Now, the Queen of Pentacles is an earth sign. This is a sign that is, um, this is a card where you have, this is like a very nurturing, um, there's that mother aspect, um, kind, compassionate, loving, okay, very grounded. And this is about you loving and nurturing yourself, also loving and nurturing those things around you, your partnerships, your relationships, and um, pouring love into uh, the things that you do. Um, also, to not be so criticizing and judgmental towards others or towards yourself but there's a major message here about loving of self okay and I feel like something similar was coming up yesterday some of you might have gone through some kind of completion okay within regards to relationship because the next card you have is you have snake spirit this is about healing okay so it's this time to heal healing and transformation i feel like you're going through a bit of a rebirth at the moment okay and an awakening um you're healing your past you're healing your relationships you're shedding old skin okay and you know underneath you have the eight of pentacles i feel like you're at a time where you're focusing on working on yourself, all right? This is about you putting time and dedication into those things that you feel passionate about that are gonna bring you the rewards that you truly deserve. So it's applying yourself to what's most important. And part of that is loving and nurturing yourself. But this is also working towards financial stability. And if you haven't had it there before, you will now as you're clearing out old things that have kind of been blocking you from your true path. And part of that is knowing your worth and believing in yourself. Matter of fact, one of the messages that came in loud and clear this morning was, don't allow anybody to ever make you feel like your dreams aren't possible. And what do you believe about yourself? What do you believe about what you can do and what you can accomplish? Because that is so important. And it's so important for you to believe in yourself and to love yourself above all. The message you have next is coyote spirit and you have trust in divine detours. So I do feel that you're having to walk away from something, something that you've put a lot of time into. I feel like you're walking away um, and it's not that it's failed, it's just that right now you need to go in a different direction. You know, um, what's what's not worked for you previously? It's almost like you've been repeating this cycle over and over and expecting different results. And it's time for you to allow the divine to show you a different way. You know, um, you're just moving in a different direction on a new path. Trust in the divine detours that are coming your way because they're leading you to a better destination. And also keep in mind, it's not about where, where you wind up, it's about the journey. And right now you're on this journey and you're having to take this detour because you've gone through some kind of heartache, possibly betrayal here, hurt. Some of you could have had an ending with a, you know, there could have been a third party scenario. Um, but this is a card of heartache. It's a, it's a card of betrayal, a card of um, feeling a loss, okay? And feeling very hurt and you know, and I feel partly because you're going through some kind of completion, some kind of cycle is ending for you. But this is also you're starting to realize that the love you're seeking is truly you. And as you do, and you're at this ending here, 
there's a beautiful brand new beginning. So I wanted to clarify this card and you got the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles is about a brand new beginning. It's about a new start, okay? One that's built on a solid foundation, one that is truly worthy of you, okay? And one that you deserve. It's the stability and the foundation that you've been seeking all along. You know, it's interesting because you had three pentacle cards here. So there's a lot of grounding energy coming in at this time. As you recognize that you are the love that you seek and you go through this time of healing, and as you allow the, the divine to guide you, kind of in a different direction, you have this beautiful blessing, this pentacle that's being presented to you. So I'm wishing you a blessed and beautiful Tuesday. Have a great day, everyone. Namaste.